I thought I'd do a little update about how everybody feels about the virus, the COVID-19 thing that's been going around. And uh, we've been wearing these face masks for months now and it's just become a routine. We've got everybody social distancing and uh, people staying in their cars in the parking lot and we're doing a lot of stuff over the phone and they come and stand at their designated spot and stay six feet apart. And every place in town is like that. And uh, it's just been, uh, it's been interesting that now there's uh, some protesting and rioting and things like that going on. There's a lot of political stuff going on right now and the, the virus seems to have taken a back seat in the news. So I think I'm gonna go around and just ask everybody, see how they feel. I'd be interested to document this and uh, just see with the year of 2020 when we look back on this, what we think about it. It's probably been, say about probably first of March we started wearing the mask. It's April, May, June, three months. Uh, has it so, really been three months? Yeah. It feels like longer than that. Yeah. So what do you think? How, how was your level of fear of the virus? Well, I still think it's a pretty real thing. Um, but, of course, I don't hear a lot about it anymore. I mean, you hear that there's new cases still, but you don't hear a lot of the, the fact that people still need to be taking precautions against it because yeah. it's still out there. It's still a thing. I mean, definitely don't want to get it. Mm -hmm. But I mean, we have so many other things going on all, all across the world. You just don't hear about it a lot. Yeah, seems like the protesting and the rioting's more mm -hmm. in the news now than the virus is. Right, and all of that, I mean, there's just plenty of new cases just coming from stuff like that too. So it's still, it's still out there. The state of Virginia has gone from closed off to phase one, now we're in phase two, and we might go to phase three and open up even further next week. So what do you think, what's your level of concern about the virus? Um, I still wear a mask when I'm out in public places like the grocery store, and obviously you wear them here at work. Um, I just got back from Atlantic Beach in North Carolina, where they are a little bit further ahead of us as far as opening up than Virginia. Um, we did not eat out at any of the restaurants we bought. We did take in uh, at the timeshare yeah. condo. Um, I, before I went to the beach, I did eat in a restaurant inside um, in Brook Neal. And when you go in, they have the tables X'd out and they have signs that say oh, these are marked so for social distancing. And I felt fine because there wasn't anybody that close by. Mm -hmm. um, I guess I'm still a little leery. I almost feel like I'm being um, overly cautious. And, but since mm -hmm. it's something we don't know, hopefully um, it's going to be over soon and it's not going to come back in the fall, mm -hmm. kind of like some of the other viruses. I hope not. The first 10 weeks of the semester, you take like three classes. Mm -hmm. And then the last five weeks of the semester, four or five weeks, you'll take two classes. So if something should happen, um, those last two, you can do them online. So, yeah, I kind of am feeling a little indifferent about it. I mean, I, I mean, I, I don't really care about it as much. I mean, thing people have been coming in here with no masks on, like nothing ever happened. So, I mean, I think there are some people who are still really nervous about it and most people seem like it's completely over. Um, but I have a feeling like we're going to get a second wave of it and it's going to come crashing hard. Um, so, I mean, I've just been still trying to be cautious and, you know, aware about staying six feet from people and yeah like it's weird because I never thought I would be the person to go out in public and be like okay like you know I might not get it but I don't want you near me yeah <laughs> so yeah it's very weird how it'll like change your mindset about being around people mm -hmm. so yeah I mean well, like I went to the dollar store and I was just getting a drink or something and there's a lady in line there's three people in line and one lady coughed and I'm like <laughs> well I'll just make another see, lap around the store yeah. and see if there's anything else I want to get and wait till she leaves before I go check out. Yeah, because, like, there's before... There's no point in me standing up there anyway. Yeah, yeah. and it's crazy because, like, before all of this happened, you wouldn't think twice about someone sneezing yeah. or coughing, and yeah. now it's like, oh, my God, do you have the Rona? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it's, uh, it's crazy how everything, you know, will, I don't know, uh -huh. make you a little bit more cautious have about Have you heard about people. schools, anything? 
Do they have any plan yet, or are they just kind of still up in the air? I have no idea what's going to happen with school. I know um, Hunter, he hasn't heard anything about, like, mm -hmm. football practice going back. Mm -hmm. and so They should have started by now, right? Yeah, they should have yeah. started a long time ago. Yeah. So, yeah, I have no idea what's going to happen, but I know it'll be a long time before mm -hmm. things get back to and I don't need any help for this one, okay? I don't need any help for this one. You could think of fart liquid, you couldn't think of intervals? No, because I don't do intervals, I do fart licks. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Who decides how you do it?